Hello guys, this is Sachi Scape. Welcome to my channel. Here I'm helping out to make website design and development skills. If you are new here, make sure you click the subscribe button and press the bell icon so that whenever I'm uploading the new videos, you will get notified every time. In addition to this video, I'm also providing the source code that I am using so that you can use for your own projects. So guys, today's topic is called Bootstrap version 4.5.2 phase 9. In this edition, I am giving you explain how to make the website with complete package. In my previous video, I have show you how to make home page, about us page, photo gallery and video gallery page with isotope contact us page here i am going to combine the, all the codes with one projects like home about us one showcase i have added and also i have added one showcase details and also the contact us and photo gallery and video gallery with isotope i combined everything no need to go somewhere else to know about how to make website i am completely giving the tutorials with small descriptions, explanation, everything. In my description box also, you can see my previous video with video, source code, everything I have given provided. To download the source code, you have to go some simple steps. First, you have to open my website called sachiscape.com. There, you have to click the articles page. When you click the articles page, there you can see lots of articles I have given for my previous video. Then you have to click Bootstrap version 4.5.2 phase 9. When you click the phase 9, it will redirect you the details page. In the details page, I have given the hashtag and some small description about the phase 9. In the down, also you can see the screenshot I have given for this HTML code. Then you can click the download button. It will redirect you to the Dropbox. When you go to the Dropbox, there you can see I have given the source code you have to download. When you download the file, you have to place this file in a WAMP or JAMP folder. Why? Because WAMP and JAMP is needed for your revolution slider or some of code is not working. For, for that, you have to see my previous video why WAMP or JAMP is needed. You can see from my description box. From there, when you paste your file in your WAMP folder, you have to on your file called localhost slash phase 9 when you run localhost slash phase 9 your file will be open there you can see the home page with the owl carousel fancy box contactors footer navigation revolution slider everything is there then you can see one overview page after that you can see the showcase showcase detail fancy box photos and video with isotope tab contact us feedback form google map with longitude and latitude everything i have provided so guys when you are going to open your file it will look like this you can see here there is index overview photos and videos showcase showcase details thank you send underscore mail dot php contact us and error message is there and also when you are going to css folder you will see the css file everything is combined then when you are going to js folder everything also there is defined and images all are there in the font for fonts folder also everything is there you can see here the fab icon also there this is completely website i have made you can see i'll show you from my previous video you have seen like I have made home page about us and uh, showcase page also photo gallery photos and videos like including with isotope and also contact us page here I have combined with everything here you can see the home page everything is there like uh, owl carousel you can see here owl carousel okay uh, this is showcase page then in the down you can see here is a media gallery page with a light box is a photo gallery then a video gallery also implemented see this is connecting through YouTube you can give your YouTube URL so that it will open the YouTube videos in the down is a footer then you have to go to the about overview page 
here you can see this navigation is activated here the header part is same only the changes is the home page there is a revolution slider you can see here one revolution slider i have given here this one this one is change inner page we are not giving any kind of revolution slider banner as per the standard here i have given one inner banner you can see the same image but you can define with your relevant image including your business standards you can give anything so here you can see the title and the breadcrumb this is called breadcrumb and one abstract paragraph image for this details you can go to the details box from my video there you can see uh, i have defined how to make this about us page then you can go to the showcase showcase from the home page whatever i have given the same thing i defined it here here you can see when you click the web designer details it will come to the details page from here also you can see web design same things okay then here photos and videos this video also i have already made you can see here this is isotof this is isotof i have given photos videos everything is defined okay then you can see here there is a contact us okay guys the contact us with feedback form google map everything is defined it okay guys then when you are going to internal page the code is there you have to open this index in notepad plus plus or dream over wherever i am using the notepad plus plus so that i am going to use this one home page with all the details whatever i have used for my previous video you can follow there i have defined it everything only what i am going to do this i am going to show you the some simple simple steps how i have included you can see here in the top there is a header and uh, title you can see then fab icon then google fonts then style bootstrap mean font asham revolution slider is here mega menu like is a navigation structure you can see here navigation and fancy box owl carousel okay guys then you can see here a custom css in the down i have included the javascript see here i have included the javascripts okay and here you can see the revolution slider this one revolution slider then you can see here the content section and after that you can see here showcase here you can see the showcase in when you are going to the home page you can see here the showcase okay is a owl carousel automatic sliding so here is a showcase code okay then when you are going to down you can see the media gallery here you can see the media gallery code and uh, this is the media gallery in the down photo gallery like this is a light box album is coming so uh, you can you for to know how to make home page i have already given in a description box you can see how to make home page i have given the specific tutorial for that you can see there only what i am going to do here i am only explain you how to make the website with some simple steps this is my end video of the page like i have already made page 1 to page 8 to make step by step here phase 9 i am combining all the codes in a single phase so it's quite easy you can see here then you can see here overview page you are going to open this overview page in a notepad plus plus or whatever like if you have dream over you can use the dream over also same i have used the css js everything is there i have removed remove the revolution slider owl carousel because what we are not using in the overview i am not using the revolution slider all owl carousel like this is the owl carousel you can see here this is owl carousel and the down one is fancy box i am not using in about us page so it's not necessary if you are making the html it's not necessary to show all the css and all the javascripts in a same page because 
it's redirecting the code loading so it's not good so what you are going to do if possible you if you are not using the code in the same page remove it no need to use so better to no need to use so i didn't use the revolution slider css and uh, the javascript whatever i am using normally you you can see the same file is there then the next page is you can see the showcase when i am going to click the showcase this is the showcase page is here the same thing what you can see here in the home page in the home page i have given the showcase listing you can see in the owl browser the showcase listing is here you can see here the same showcase is coming here okay the mouse over the plus icon is coming everything the all code is there i have just copy and paste the showcase page so the showcase also nothing we are not using anything so only the showcase is there as the same style with overview you can see the showcase details it's a web designer page i have used some web designer image and some inner banner you can use different inner banner to looks better i just want to show you how to make website inner pages with specific element then you are going to photos and videos also i have made a tutorial for photos and videos with isotope this tab is called isotope with this with this tab i have already made this video also you can see this how to make photos and videos tutorial in the description box so is easy for you i'm i'm going to show you this photos and videos page in a dream over or uh, you can see in any other software i'm using notepad plus plus here you can see i have i only used this uh, like uh, fancy box you can see here because i'm using the light box fancy box you can see here then in a down the relevant code only you can see the fancy box code the isotope code only here that's it then you are going to go to then i'm going to open the contact us page my last video like phase 8 i made the contact us page with feedback form and uh, google map you can see here how i integrate the google map and uh, the contact us form with validation i've already made this video you can see also the description box see so it's pretty used and uh, i just combine with the same folder so that uh, for the beginner or those wants to make a website they can easily use i'm uh, i'm also going to show you how to give the email id the same field this is the normal field people are giving like first name last name isd code you can give any other code like the country email id the drop down anything it's like i've just given uh, any normal use and you can use any different name here you can see the message and the submit and this submit is going you have to give some different email id here i have given my personal email id you can give your own any other corporate email id or any personal email id you can give the cc also like ss at gmail.com you can give multiple email id with comma space the rest email id and if you want to give the third email id also it's possible so 1 2 3 4 any email id you can give and the message is going to thank you page and if it is submit is going to thank you page if the message throwing error it will open the error message and the contact us page is a contact us page that's why is i have given the contact us page so the pretty much easy and if you have any doubt you can ping me in my description box all right guys now we are going to end up with this video if you are really enjoy with my tutorial please like subscribe and press the bell icon so that whenever i'm uploading the new videos you will get notified every times also you can follow me with my social media account stay safe thank you bye bye